Good morning, everybody. Good morning. Woo! Um, skip to the last two days on here. Oh, I'm tired. Uh, skip the last two days on here, and uh, I got a bunch of people commenting and and hitting me up and stuff, saying saying if we're okay, for if you know if everything's good, and uh, yeah. Um, other than I just looked down and I saw ketchup all over the side of our countertop because Danielle the other day was getting ketchup. I got paint particles in my mouth, um, and she got the bottle to shake it so you don't get the, uh, you know, that liquid and ketchup, the uh, watery consistency at the top, and she shook it, and the lid was on, and it went, poof, and it went everywhere, and now I just saw it on the side of our uh, cabinet here, so she may, she may wash this later. Danielle, <laughs> thinking about you. <laughs> She, uh, she had to work, and uh, she she's at the house, and she'll be coming out. Uh, we've been working on um, some stuff, as you guys can tell. Got paint and stuff on my hands, and I wasn't able to sleep very good last night. I mean, I was tired, but my mind just wouldn't stop. It was just, just moving and moving. I don't know what time I finally fell asleep, but it was pretty late, and... Uh, I don't know. It sucks. I'm tired, but I'm uh, very, very happy and uh, excited about uh, the progress we're making and 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 what we're working on and and all of that. And it's I don't know. It's exciting. I know I'm not showing it, uh, but the last few days it's just it was just nasty weather. I mean, just nasty, rainy. Everything out here is complete mush. Uh, there is nothing dry around here. Uh, the truck I drove over to the uh, shop to feed the animals because I didn't want to take the side by side because it was raining so hard, and uh, I, I got stuck. And then luckily uh, I was able to get out, but it took me about like five ten minutes of just back and forth in the truck to get out of the mud. I mean. Out here, as soon as it gets wet, it's just slick, slick, and then if it rains for a long time, you just sink. Uh, it's just uh, straight like clay in some areas, and uh, it's it's bad. So uh, I took the last two days off, kind of just uh, trying to sleep in a little bit extra, trying to catch up on the sleep. So I haven't been able to go to sleep early, uh, but. Um, I don't know. I, I I truly feel like got the uh, creative side back. Uh, I I have my guitar out here now. Uh, I had the drum set, and um, my buddy Brandon brought like a bass guitar and acoustic guitar out here. Uh, so with some of the rain lately, uh, I I gave myself some time to play guitar and get that creative side back. Um, I have been messing around with like Photoshop and doing uh, photo editing, like off the wall editing. Uh, I have been watching videos on how to make videos better. Uh, I, I'm the type that it would seem like my head is all over the place, which it is, but, uh, and it's just like, oh, I want to do this. I'm tired of this. Oh, I want to do this. Oh, I'm tired of this. Oh, it's just more of my mind can't stop. And I, I don't, I mean, I'm sure it's ADD, ADHD, I don't freaking know what's wrong with me. But um, I truly see it as, like, a creative power. And when I'm not utilizing my my brain doing a bunch of different things, that's where I get stuck in a rut. And uh, that's why, you know, we got off of working off the tiny house for a long time. It, took, it takes a while to do projects because... I feel just, I feel like it becomes just like a, I know this is dumb to say, but a job. Uh, it is my job to do YouTube, but um, it feels very, I don't know, mundane, I guess. It feels like it's just, alright, let's get up and do this. 
win, it should be like, yes, let's do this. I'm trying to create something. I'm, I'm doing this. I'm, I'm trying to create something new. So with me playing guitar, um, you know, that's bringing it back. And as soon as I picked up a guitar, I haven't played in a long time. Oh, it was bad. And then it started getting better and better. Uh, I'm not a drummer by any means, but now I'm actually getting like good beats and I'm doing good fills and stuff and and uh, just like recording little quick songs to just, you know, play around with it. And uh, just that alone um, has opened my, my brain back up to being creative and being excited to be creative and uh, I think that's something that a lot of people out there they get burnout they don't have something to look forward to they don't have something that makes their brain tick so you gotta find what makes your brain stay creative I guess that's that's how I have to do it so if you're having problems coming up if you're a YouTube channel you have problems coming up with content, maybe try to do something that you truly enjoy. Do something that's creative. I don't really, I don't, I don't know what. Maybe you like to sing. Maybe even like, uh, maybe doing even uh, puzzles or like cr uh, crossword puzzles because it, it makes you think. It makes you get creative. And with puzzles, you gotta, it's, you know, you gotta, you gotta, you know what the vision is, but now you got to find all these little pieces, figure out what goes what. It keeps your brain moving, and uh, with you know with with me, uh, it's it's music. Uh, with Danielle, I know this may sound crazy, but I think it's video games. Uh, she loves playing video games, and I I could see it being. In a video game, you gotta you gotta think, you gotta strategize, you gotta do this, and it's fun. But it keeps your brain creative and thinking and, and multitasking and and doing stuff. So when you get back into the real world, uh, doing whatever job you're doing, or you know us building the house or working around here, it's it, it gets your brain thinking about stuff like that. So I guess basically what I'm getting at with all this is don't. Try to just do the same thing every day. Don't try to just, you wake up, you you do the exact same routine, you do the exact same job, you do the exact same whatever every day. Figure something out if you don't have a hobby or, or anything like that. Even just go for a walk. When Whenever I go for a walk or a run, all you have time for is to think. You, you start thinking about different things and and especially I don't know when I run I have to focus on running my breathing but then it just that goes away <clears throat> and the next thing I know I'm just thinking about all the things I want to do how am I going to accomplish it stuff like that so that's an awesome thing that you could do uh, go for a walk kind of the same thing uh, you know anything you could do that's not just Sit on the couch, turn the TV on. Uh, go do the exact same job you do every day. Sit at a computer and just type doing your job. Uh, doing phone calls. Doing well, I don't know what your job is. I don't know what you do daily. But you have to do something that gets you active, gets you moving, gets you creating, gets you thinking differently. And uh, whatever it is, just figure out what your passion is. Something that can you can get creative at. Something, you know, again, it could be doing a puzzle, crossword puzzle. Uh, do something that makes your brain think and makes your brain try to create new ways to do things. And with me, that's playing guitar and trying to learn new riffs, trying to learn new chords. Uh, I'm learning how uh, to record better. I used to record music. Now... Um, I'm learning how to do it better. Again, I'm learning how to play drums. Uh, doing drums, you really have to work on tempo and time. You really got to think. Uh, you know, so everything like that has truly helped me stay creative, helped me stay motivated because now if I'm doing a, a project and I'm working on a project for YouTube, all I'm thinking is, ooh, I can't wait to go play guitar after. Oh, I can't wait to, uh, you know, do something, uh, you know, if, if, we get done, Danielle can play video games and I can edit, uh, uh, you know, some photos that I took and I want to, like, make them look crazy or whatever. It 
it, it just helps in so many ways if you have a hobby, if you have something that's creative. So, if you have that burnout, uh, that's my suggestion. That works for me, and uh, I think it's proof is in the pudding. You guys, you know, uh, I think have seen a change, and uh, hopefully you guys have a great day. I might go live tonight on the Crockers, maybe. I was going to go live last night, but... Um, I just got caught up doing what I was doing um, for the video tomorrow that you guys will see. But uh, hopefully you guys have a great day. Uh, missed two days. Appreciate everyone that reached out. It was overwhelming. Um, so if I didn't reach back out, you know, nothing against you. Uh, it's just more of kind of overwhelming. And then uh, just been working like crazy out here trying to get stuff done. So we'll catch you on the next one. Guys, stay creative. And if you want something bad enough... You'll make it happen.